Hey everybody, Bleeker here, your resident engineer. And today we are going to do some more Factorio as played by an engineer. I got a request to continue on the series, so hell, we're going to continue on the series. So in today's episode, I have a real treat for you. We're actually going to finish off the power and we're going to begin the starting area and probably finishing up next finishing our starting area next episode so our beginning factory we'll get that started today um last episode we basically just set up some drills um produced i did a little bit of resource production off camera you know good stuff like that yeah we're looking good we're in we're actually in pretty good shape i got lots of resources saved up these aren't gonna last us for shit but that's besides the point um so today let's finish up our power here really quick and drop in a spoiler steam engine boiler steam engine boiler hey steam engine eh. boiler steam engine jeez i still have two more of these boiler did i produce wait one two three four five six seven eight I have to tree. I have to remove trees. This isn't Factorio as played by a lumberjack. Come on. Jesus Christ. I'm not paid to be a lumberjack. I'm paid to build things, not cut down trees. Jeez, I'm going to bleaker's hedge, hedge service. Okay. Thank you, autosave. Good, we made it work. That makes me happy. You can't tell because I'm angry, but it makes me happy. Alright, so this is our power taken care of. For the time being, we're actually going to have to expand up towards our power at some point. But I want to lay down my electric mining drills right away. So what these are going to allow us to do is mine things without the need for coal. And it may seem like I'm just randomly setting these down there. And you'd be correct, I am, because this is the starting area and it doesn't really matter. So we're going to need power. I have my poles here. We're just going to get everything hooked into the grid. Nice. Everything's all hooked into the grid, I hope. Yep, everything appears to be. And let's just bring down power. Damn it, I ran out of poles. I did not pre-plan for this episode very well. Let's just make a metric ton. That was close, I almost said shit. But I didn't. Okay, so from here, bring these over. Boom, power. Boom, powered. All right, so this isn't going to do us any good just like this. So next step... Oh, Jesus, I'm still producing stuff. So next step is we actually have to bring power up, or we have to bring coal up to these so we can power our boilers. So let's see here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven... 13. Okay, it's 13. <laughs> okay, in the meantime... Eh. Wow, I didn't realize I was producing so much stuff. Let's kind of plan out what we're going to do here. So I'm just going to take all that. Thank you. I'm going to need you and you, and we're probably going to need that. So what we're going to do here is going to bring our iron up and make a smelting facility bring our coal up and make a smelting facility and the remainder of the coal we're actually going to swing up and bring over to here which is why I'm making the inserters so that when I bring my conveyor belts up and I want everything but the rest of it in conveyor belts perfect excellent that's looking pretty good 
Nice. So now we're making conveyor belt. Slowly, I can assure you, as slow as possible. Here at Factorio, as played by an engineer, we insist on only inconveniencing you the most amount that we possibly can to make this series as boring and repetitive as possible. Thank you! Finally, some belt. Alright, so belt I'm gonna put here. Save that spot. My inserters gonna want at all times here. Perfect. That is looking pretty average at best. So now let's bring the coal line up. So coal, I don't like that positioning. Actually, while I'm at this, there we go. So what I'm doing here is I'm hitting my, um, my middle button on my mouse and saving its position. Oh, that was in exactly the right place that I wanted it the whole time. I am stupid. So let's just begin power feeding at this point. You know what, I really just want to bring my coal up right away, so I don't have to worry about it any longer. And I also want to run out of belt in the middle of this as well, because, you know, that's something I like to do all the time. Bring this up. Um, let's at least get these four powered on. Yeah. I at least want these four right here at the start of the circuit to be powered on. Otherwise, otherwise my OCD will trigger and you really don't want that when I'm triggered. Boom! Power. So that should handle our power, our immediate power needs. Do I have the ability to do anything? Ah, damn it, I don't. Okay. I'm going to need some more iron here because we need to set up our labs because otherwise I'm going to uh, research myself, not research myself into a corner. I'm not going to be able to access some of the things that I'm going to need to be able to set up my facility. Woo! Ric Flair, woo! What else am I going to need? I'm going to need a lot more iron, actually. So that's producing that. Let's bring up our, our iron. I really want to do this. What is going to happen, though, is I think I'm just going to kind of, when I get splitters, and if you don't know what splitters are, you'll find out. We're going to split half of our coal going up this way, and we're going to make the, svel the svelting facility. The, 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 you get the point. I'm actually just going to move where my copper line is, so I might be able to kind of plan that out a little bit more. Copper will run on this side. Perfect. Okay, so this lab is just going to be temporarily set there. Woo! Fancy. And I want this first. Actually, no. I want this one first so I can at least begin. So that's going to require 20 red science packs, which I don't quite have enough to make all 20. Now I do. Booyah! So that's getting all set up, and now I can't actually craft anything. I am, as my inventory is otherwise preoccupied. The one thing that I hate about this early game is, at the very least, I am going to get copper starting to back up. And what really sucks is this takes forever for me to actually make, which means I might just end up researching. Where's my research tab? R. That's my menu. Production bonuses, minion transit. How do I access research again? There we go, T. Which means I might just end up doing the assembly machines because they can make things a hell of a lot faster and free up my inventory space. So as soon as I get 10, I'm actually going to research this first. 9 and magic number. 10. Okay, let's cancel out all of that. And let's build belts. As you can 
is rule number one of belt. There is never enough belt. Come on. Rule number one of belt. Yeah, there's never enough belt. No matter how efficiently you try and make something, there is just never, ever enough belt. In fact, I need even more belt. Damn game. So this initial smelting area is going to be kind of limited in size, and I'm going to kind of bottleneck myself in this area at some point because that's how I pre-plan this. God, I'm an idiot. But we'll overcome and adapt to this. Actually, I've got a lot of room here. I'll be able to make that work, actually. I'll... That's the one thing that I hate, is I don't pre-plan even though I should, and it ends up, like I said, bottlenecking me in here. Okay, so then let's bring our bringing iron up like this. <clears throat> My lack of pre-planning is pissing me off. What I can actually do though is begin setting up the smelting area for copper. Where's all this stuff for... Oh, shit, that's done already. I want that next. Oh, which means, um... I still need more iron. Damn. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. That should be plenty. Five starting off here. So let's do one, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Now, if any of you are have watched any of my previous videos and how I do my efficient smelting setup, or efficient smelting setup and production stuff, yeah, you're going to be a little disappointed because that's not going to be a thing that I'm going to be doing. Mildly unfortunate. I know. Trust me, I'm just as disappointed as you guys are. I was really looking forward to setting this whole starting up efficiently, but it's the startup area. It was never meant to be made efficiently. I want my long hand to actually be there. There we go. Now that's looking okay. So I'm going to need iron gears. Okay. Okay. Very nice, very nice. So I just make iron gears, throw in all that copper, and actually give it some power. Oh, that was bad planning. We'll just kind of automate this a little bit so I don't have to worry about it as much. Oh hell, why stop there? More iron, please. Thank you. I want that. Perfect. Take that. Take that. Start producing that. You. I'm going to have you. Oh, come on. There we go. We'll have this assembly machine start making iron gears. So I can just shove in. Forget all about it. How do I do? There we go. Now I can see what everything's making. That should hold us over for a extended period of time. And while that's researching logistics, I can get the rest of this smelting facility all set up. Come on, get in there. There you go. How are these guys doing? I'll top them off as well. Bitchin'. Thank you, autosave. You are my true best friend. Okay, so that's plenty backed up, so I'm just going to switch into that line right there, which means that by doing that... Oh, are you kidding me? Really, has it already been 15? 
You know what? We're going for 20. Set timer for five minutes. Okay, five minutes and counting. Thank you, Siri. You know what? We're just going to go all the way on this one. We're going to at least get a little bit further on this smelting here because this has been a really uneventful first episode. It's just me being relatively unprepared for everything. Wire that into the power grid. Sweet. Making stuff. Making iron, actually. We've just automated iron. I am best at this. Sweet. Alright, good. Now that that's almost done, how's logistics coming? Keep doing the good work, fellas. You're doing good. You're doing good. And we'll throw on like another half stack because I forgot these only make one. Oh, that is so nice. So very nice to see that. So I guess um, new goal this episode, finish the smelting facility. Why not? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One more. Perfect. Ah, oh, now I don't have to worry so much. How many more do I need? Five, six, seven, seven? Make me all of them. Oh. Iron being my limiting factor. Ha! Huh. Who would have ever thunk? But in all seriousness, yeah, early game, iron is going to be your best friend. How are we coming on logistics? Once we get that, I get my splitter, which will be very good. Oh, the tool belt. But that's going to be expensive, and I'm not about that life. Well, I guess I'll just wire everything into power here. I promise you guys, I am an engineer, kind of, and I do know what I'm doing. Maybe. I don't know. I'll let you know when I figure that part out. Sweet. So now we are making resources like mad. I can pretty easily expand this if need be. And research is almost done. That's looking good. It's looking good. What I will do is add in one more I'm not really going to need these as much anymore I'm going to add in one more electric mining drill oh belt you're killing me I can't wait until I automate belt one more electric mining drill just to have more belt capacity going for us oh I forgot to put one now we're cooking with gas. Yeah, we're going to need a lot more. Um, oh, sweet. That's done. Nice. Um, what else do I want to build immediately? Wall! Nope, not about that wall. That would be nice, actually. I guess iron tools or steel tools would be next. There we go. There you go, buddy. All right, um, I guess that is, how much is left on my timer? 50 seconds. All right, guys, that is all the time I have for right now. Uh, when we come back next time, we are actually going to begin producing stuff over in this area right here. I will connect up the rest of my stuff to power. Ah, oh, look at that. We're actually doing pretty good. Doing pretty good, actually. Yeah, I'm going to connect the rest of my stuff to power, or connect belt to the rest of these for power. We'll get producing of resources. I'm going to definitely have to chop down some of this forest. And the episode after that, possibly get our smelting facility set up over there. Because it's actually relatively, actually up here is relatively clear. So I might do something up here and um, kind of go from there. But guys, until next time, this has been your resident engineer, Bleaker. 
And until next time, guys, be seeing ya. Thank <laughs> you.